Please don't be bad. I guess you're pretty hungry, too. Here you go. Hey, you don't eat it all. Here you go. Hey, you don't eat it all.
Come on, kid. We gotta get I think... I think we're safe. Yeah. Yeah, we're good. Hey, you alright? I... I think so. What are you doing out here? Where are the, uh, the people you're with? There's no chance you made it this long on your own. I'm alone. Everyone I know is gone. It's just me now. I'm sorry to hear that. I just lost a sister. We've all lost folks. Well, I'm Luke. And this is Pete. Hey there. Hi. I'm Clementine. It's nice to meet you, Clementine. Now for now, we're gonna take you back to our group. Okay, we got a doctor with us, and you look like you could use some- OH SHIT! Uh, uh, what? What is it? She's- She's been bit, man. Fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. What are we gonna do here? No! It was a dog! I didn't see any dog, Clementine. Come on, kid. We just saw you with those lurkers back there. No. No, just look at it, please. <laughs> yeah, and have you sink your teeth into Pete's neck? No way. My neck? Why am I the one? Because I don't know a dog bite from a mosquito bite from a lurker bite, man. It's not. Hmm. All right. Let's see it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, watch yourself. Hey, don't look at me like that. You're the one that's bit here, okay? Is it, uh, is it like she says? Well, it could be a dog. Hard to say. So where'd this dog go? The one that did this? Now what, what does that matter, Pete? Seriously. I, I killed it. What? Really? A dog shows up and bites you and you just kill it? What would you have done? I don't know. It attacked me. Still, you don't, you don't kill dogs. Clementine? Yes? You telling us the truth? You looked me in the eyes when you answered. Yes. All right, Clementine. That's good enough for me. Well, what else was she gonna say? I've got a good bullshit detector, Luke. That's why you can never beat me at poker. <laughs> you don't always beat me at... All right, how can you be sure? Well, I'm sure I ain't willing to leave a little girl in the woods to die when we got a doctor with us that can make a call. We can have Carlos take a look at it first. Nick ain't gonna like this. Not with what happened. You don't have to remind me of that, boy. Right. Sorry, sir. Come on. Clementine, are you feeling all right? I'm fine. Just tired. Well, you better be fine, because I ain't carrying you anymore with that bite on your arm. Don't worry about... Ah, oh, shit! What? And you just believed her? You should have put her out of her misery right there. Dog bite my ass. I need a dog. Keep your finger off the trigger, boy. 
Whoa! Whoa! What the you fuck? You idiot! Every lurker for five miles probably heard You're the that. one telling me to fucking shoot her. Everybody just calm down for a second. Clementine, you okay? I just need a doctor. And then, and then I'll go. I don't want my arm to get infected. None of us want to get infected. That's the point. We got a doctor right here, okay? He'll have a look. Now what the hell is wrong with you people? Okay, she's just scared. We're all scared, Luke. Don't act like we're the ones being irrational because we don't buy this bullshit story. No way she survived out here on her own. Why are we even arguing about this? Let me take a look. It's okay. Go ahead, he's a doctor. Must have hurt. Hmm. Whatever it was, it got you good. This isn't how we do things, man. When you're bit, you get put down. End of story. I'm not going through this again. No one's suggesting that. We could take her arm off. <gasps> I know that worked for a cousin down in Ainsworth. We could try that. It won't do any good. You'll just be making it worse for the girl. It's crazy. No one's going to volunteer to do that. I would. If it means saving her. You seem pretty smart. You want to be sure about this, right? You don't want to do something you're going to regret. I promise you, it was just a dog bite. That's all it was. She. Sarah, what I say, stay inside. I don't mean to be any trouble. I just want to stop the bleeding and then I'll go. You'll never see me again, I promise. And where exactly would you go? I can take care of myself. Clearly. I'm no doctor or nothing. Uh, I'm, I'm good with whatever you decide. But maybe we should be sure before we go off and do something crazy. I'm just saying. So, what do you think? Was it a lurker? A bite like that? Could be anything. Only one way to find out. How? We wait. What? By tomorrow morning, if the fever set in, we'll know if she's gonna turn. In the meantime, we can lock her in the shed. What about my arm? It needs to get cleaned and, and stitched and bandaged. The girl is in bad shape, Carlos. And we have all that stuff inside the cabin. We could probably get by Out with it. Out, please. But, yeah, we can't do nothing. I'm not wasting supplies on a lurker bite. If it turns out you're telling the truth, I'll clean it and stitch it up for you in the morning. But... I'm sorry. It's the best we're gonna get. Finger off the trigger, son. I ain't your son. Don't be like that, man. It's all right. Boy's got his mom's temper. Come on. This is just a waste of time. You'll see. And when she turns, I ain't gonna be the one cleaning up the ship. It was a dog. You'll see. I guess we'll find out in the morning. If I last that long, maybe you could go look for it? I wish I could. I really do, but it's too risky. Sorry. for this way, and I'd rather be sure. Yeah. <sighs> I can't believe this. You're gonna be fine. You're gonna be fine.
not much left in here. I guess if I have to, I can use this for stitches. House meeting in five minutes. That's good. It won't take long. There's a few things we need to discuss. has more to say, I guess. Where's Sarah? She's got her book. She doesn't need to be a part of this. Thank <laughs> you. 
could be. We don't know. She's connected to somebody. There's no way she's out here by herself. She said she's out here alone. Yeah, right. Whoever she's with, they'll probably come looking for her. Great. They show up and we've got her locked in the shed. You think we should bring her in here? No, I'm just saying it wouldn't look too good. It's just a precautionary measure. Anyone else would do the same. You really think Carver would come after us? You think he wouldn't? Out there to die. Better her than us. You'd have done the same. It wasn't the brightest idea. Oh, well, firing your rifle was, huh? Next time we'll just put up a neon sign, says the Where are you going, huh? I want to get my sweater. We'll be going in a minute. Sounds crazy, but look, for whatever reason, I think she's telling the truth. Look, there's no point in arguing about it now. She's in the shed, she's not gonna hurt anyone. We'll just see what's what. That who? The girl could really die. If the infection spreads, anything's possible. It could definitely get a whole lot worse for her. Don't we have penicillin? Or something that can you know, stop the infection spreading? I don't know if it's We're not wasting anything on her. What if one of us needs it? Look, I'm just saying we can help her, that's all. We need to think of ourselves first. That's just the way it is. We can't just let her die. Not if there's something we can do. Let's go 
think he's telling the truth, and if he doesn't, sir, then what happens? We apologize for being assholes. We help fix our She can't stay with us. We barely have enough supply to ourselves. We've got more fish in the traps than we could ever Yeah, but she's seen us. She knows we're here. What? Are you scared of a little girl? A little girl is not the problem. It's who she might tell. We gotta keep an eye on If she doesn't eat, this is probably I gotta take a leap. Hold on, we're almost done. My point is, if a little girl can find her way here, then almost anyone can. Hey, you saw those lurkers, right? That's more than we've seen in a while. Yeah, it seems like it's not as safe as it was. At least not like when we found this place. Maybe it's time to move on. We can't just keep running. At some point, we've got to settle down. We should, and we will. But can we find somewhere safe? I don't know. This doesn't like this place. Look, we've had a good run here. If it's time to move on, then I got no problem with that. Yeah, but where do we go from here? No more cities. We all agreed on that, right? Too many damn murders. We're not going back the way we came. That's for damn sure. We can probably find somewhere better. We just need to look. Wherever we go, we can't get to attack. We'll be fine, as long as we keep things clear. to be in here. Hi. Can you please help me? I'm not supposed to talk to you. My dad can't know. What are you reading? A book? What book? I like books. It's called The Gurgles. It's about transdimensional body snatchers. Cool. What happened to you? A dog bit me. Sounds scary. I bet it hurts. I could die if I don't take care of it. Do you understand? I need something to clean it with. Bandages. And I need to sew some of it up. It's too deep. My dad says we're out of real bandages. But I know where to get something to clean it. That's what this applies. I'll help you. Good. Thank you. I'm Sarah. I'm Clementine. We're friends. Right? We can be best friends. I haven't met another girl my age since way before. It's hard to be the only girl, you know? Rebecca is okay, but she's old. And that's it. And if her baby is a girl, it'll be forever before she's old enough to, like, be my friend. And then I'll be so old. We're not the same age. What? We're not the same age. You said we were. We're not. How old are you? I'm 15. I'm younger. A lot. You don't seem like it. That's just how it is. So we can be friends then. 
Eventually. That's not a real answer. I just don't know you, then I'm not helping you. I won't tell my dad you're out, but leave me alone. Wait. Yes or no? Yes. A pinky swears forever. See if I can find the stuff my dad uses when I get a gun. Let me look around. I think this is it. That'll work. You can't do it here, though. Someone will find you. Don't worry. I won't. Thanks, Sarah. 